Hey guys, we're back. This is Final Fantasy 1. This is our Final Fantasy 1 LP, and this is episode 15. Last time we left off, um, we really didn't do much. I mean, we got the life spell, and we got the uh, Faraga spell, but that was pretty much it. Um, I was having been a bit of a dilemma trying to decide what kind of white magic to get. Uh, it was going to be either Kuraga and Hilara, or Diaga, or something like that. But, you know, I thought about it, and I've already got Kira. Why not just get Hilara so I can have an advanced heal for everyone? And then I can get Diaga, and that'll be my advanced Dia. And boom! Because I've already got I've already got an advanced Cure spell. I've got Kira. Now I've got Hilara. Ho ho ho! And we've got Diaga too. Um you guys are wondering how I managed to get all that money so quickly. Here's a secret. I went to the Cavern of Earth, and on the first level of the Cavern of Earth, there's a, uh... It's a little corridor off to the side, on the first floor. And that whole corridor, every step you take, you will get into a random battle with a monster called a Hilgigas. Looks like that. It's spelled like that. Gives you 879 gil, 879 experience. You'll level up really fast if you just stay on that corridor. You can probably get to like level 30 in maybe an hour. <coughs> if you're really crazy. Just remember that um, you need to be careful about your HP and your MP because these guys will... <coughs> uh, even Ryan can't take one down by himself just yet. Maybe unless I tempered him. Um, but yeah, there's that's that's that was pretty much my way. I managed to get a lot of money and a lot of experience in 10, 15 minutes, I guess. <coughs> Pardon me. But anyway, we're gonna go. We're gonna go to the Cavern of Earth, and I will show you where that's at. So yeah, that way when you guys decide that you want to play, if any of you decide you want to play. Um, you know, you can take that advice and just run through there a couple of times, and you'll be good to go. Uh, for our white, for our black magic spells, we can't take teleport, so let's just get Scourge, even though I don't really care for instant kill spells, mainly because they very rarely, if ever, work, and slower. It should reduce one foe's number of attacks. Not sure if it really works, but we'll find out. 9,882. That's cool. Alright. <coughs> so, we are af- af- We are after the cavern of earth. <coughs> mm, sorry, guys. My throat's not feeling very well, suddenly. <coughs> kind of feels like I'm going hoarse. Eight shadows. Seventy four, two twenty one. Now that. Ah, preemptive strike. Oh, kind of get an itch there. Alright. The corridor I was talking about is through here to the left. I don't want to use my magic too much, because I really need to save it for when we get to a boss. Or a bigger monster, like say the Hilgigas. The Hilgigas? <coughs> Actually, you know what? I'm basically going to show you guys the corridor, and after that, I'm going to do some leveling up some more. <coughs> because, like I said, you can never be too safe. Or too careful. Or too something. Get it for DP too, too, too prepared, I guess. Here goes. The problem with this one is that you always. Uh, you all. Mm. 
A lot of the time I seem to end up getting into fights with the, uh... Lizard and the Hilgus. I just want the Hilgus! I think four of them would be a blessing. Usually I just get two, though. See that? 300-something experience and almost a over a thousand gil, actually. And yeah, this guy hits pretty hard. 879 gil. Cute. Ambushed! <coughs> Help! Ambushed! Beat him until he dies! <coughs> is that lizard got a green tongue, or is he just drooling acid? Ah, oh, great, there's two of them. That's just what I need. Fira works pretty well, and it doesn't cost as much as Faraga. <coughs> Pardon me. <coughs> Sorry. Ambushed! Again! Well, this is familiar. Until note, they can't use magic. Lara. Fira. Please don't smack my mage. Please don't smack my mage. Please don't smack my mage. You can smack those guys all you want. I don't care. Just don't smack my mage. For God's sake, don't smack my mage. Sounds nasty. Hey, Lara gives us all at least a hundred. Cool. Wait, how much does it cost, though, to use it? 25, compared to heals, 10. On the other hand, heal gives us about 30 per time, per use. So that's 30, 30, 30, 30. It's 120... <clears throat> just to break the uh, Hilara's... That's four uses just to break the Hilara's, you know, 100. Uh, Hilara costs 100, costs 25, but with heal, we have to use it four times just to even break even. Even break even. Makes perfect sense, don't it? So in this case, the Hilara actually works better. Probably better than Cure, actually. Well, maybe. Don't know, you have to calculate it by... Three times on one person, or I don't know. Huh. I don't know. I have no idea. Ah. Okay. I will stop trying to calculate things in my brain. I can already hear somebody saying, "You don't have one of those." Here, 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 here. So yes, as you can tell, this is a uh, very profitable venture. But we're going to leave this corridor for now. <coughs> oh, pardon me. 206, 190. 100 gil! Don't ask me why I'm making strange singing sounds. Oh boy, the Minotaur. He's a tough little bastard. And I do mean tough. I mean very tough. Okay, well he's strong. He ain't no Hilgagus, but damn it, he's close. <coughs> Pardon me. <laughs> oh, man. <coughs> My throat's killing me. I guess once we discover uh, where this little corridor here leads to... Mm. Oh. Hey! 1,975 gil. 
Money's always nice. No, you kill that one, you kill that one, you kill that one, and you kill that one. There's a guy who posted on one of my earlier videos and said that the Ogre Chief looks like the Hulk, and it was actually kind of right. I mean, green skin, purple clothes. I don't care for anacondas. Anaconda are the uh, stronger version of the cobra. Which is probably obvious. But since they're calling them anaconda, I wonder if they still use poison or not. Curious, sir. Curious, sir. I want to wipe that off. Alrighty. So, we found money. We are going to save, and we will be back eventually. Once I'm, like, level 30.